This is Hands-On Equations, Lesson 6, where we learn about parentheses and equations. Here you can see that the new skill that's been added is parentheses around um, x plus 3. So this means to double or two times what the, what's in parentheses. So we're going to show that by first covering up the number in front and building x plus 3, or putting on x plus 3 and then revealing the two to say double it. And when we show something doubled, I want you to show it stacked on top of each other so that you can see both. I don't mean stacked on top of each other like this so that it's a tall tower, but laying one above each other on the mat. Then on the opposite side, it is x plus eight. Now we can use our normal legal moves to simplify this equation. We can take a, an x, a pawn from each side or an x from each side. And then I can see that this together makes 6. So I think about what number plus 6 makes 8? It is 2. So then I would build back my equation and I would check to see if 2 makes sense. 2, 4 plus 6 makes 10. Over here, 2 plus 8 equals 10. So this would work. Let's do two practice problems together. So first, I would see that there are parentheses, which means I'm going to double what's in the parentheses. So I'm going to cover up the 2 and set up 2x plus 1. Now this comes back and tells me to double everything I've already put on there. So I'm going to put on two more x right above and then a 1 also right above. And this is like 4x now and 2. Then on the opposite side, I'm going to put on an 18. Now I can use um, a legal move to remove the same amount from both sides. So I'm going to remove a 2. This 1 plus 1 is 2. I'm going to remove 2 from both sides. So 18 minus 2 is going to make 16. So at the same time I take this away, I'm going to take away 2 here by changing it to a 6. Now I see that something 4 times makes 16. Well, I know that 4, time, four times makes 16. 4, 8, 12, 16 makes 16. So I know that x equals 4, and then I'm going to put back my equation in order to check it. I started with those over here, and then also this was an 18. So now I'm going to plug in 4 to see if this equation balances. 4, 8, 12, 16, 17, 18. And this side equals 18 as well. So x does equal 4. My last practice problem. I'm going to do x plus 4, and then I'm going to go back, and this 2 tells us to double everything that's inside the parentheses. So we're going to have another pawn and another 4 on the opposite. Oh, and then I have another x to add to that. On the opposite side, I have an x and a 12, or 10 plus 2. So now I'm going to use my legal moves to remove a pawn from both sides. Now I can't take away any more pawns because I don't have any on this side, but I do have eight. Four plus four is eight, so I can take away eight from both sides. So I'm gonna take away both of these, but 12 minus eight is gonna make four. So at the same time I take away these guys, I'm gonna turn this into a four. Now I see that something plus itself must equal 4, so it's going to be 2 plus 2 equals 4. x equals 2. Now I want, in order to check, I'm going to build back my original physical setup. So I'm going to start with x plus 4, and then I'm going to double it, x plus 4. I'm going to put on another x. On the opposite side, I had an x and a 12. Now I'm going to check it using by plugging in 2 for the pawns. 2, 4, 6 
plus 4 is 10, plus 4 more is 14. On the opposite side, I have 10 plus 2 is 12, plus 2 more is 14. So it does work that x equals 2. So you're getting ready to start lesson 6. When you get lesson 6, you will see that you have four problems here that have parentheses. Remember each time to double what is inside the parentheses and show them one um, set above the other. And then remember when you go to check it to be sure to build back the original physical setup. And then as always, you have several um, problems down here to review what you've already done. Remember each time that you must use the mat and the materials to demonstrate each and every problem. You may get started.